What's up you guys, it's Ness. Today I'm coming back to another video. If you haven't seen the title by now, it's gonna be on how to shoot digital. It's a really simple concept. A lot of people don't know how to do it though, so I'm gonna show you how to do it to get you right. Today I'm working with a model that I've worked with already. Lee Him, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, we. <laughs> I am using the Sony 24 1.4 G Master today to get a lot of the full body shots, and I'm using the Sony 50 millimeter to get the closer, the closer tight up, tight, tight up shots, the closer shot. Yeah, it's really simple. When you're shooting digitals, typically it's like six shots, you know what I'm saying? But they're like the most important photos in a model's portfolio because it helps them get booked by agencies and different kinds of gigs, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. So, you know, I hope you guys learned something today, and let's just get right into it, you know what I mean? I don't want to talk too much. Okay, so my first tip for shooting digitals is when you're shooting full body shots, you want to shoot lower. Why? Because it'll make the model look taller. And when it comes to dealing with any model, you want to give them some length. So whenever you're shooting the full body shots, typically aim for like waist level, get down low and then you know what i'm saying don't shoot too low you know what i'm saying you're not trying to make them look too grand and too tall so yeah always shoot low on the full body shots so my next tip for shooting digitals is use lots of natural light you don't need a bunch of modifiers you don't need a bunch of crazy nothing all you need is a nice room that just gets a lot of natural light white wall that's it you want to keep everything as natural as possible so whatever clients that the models are trying to attract they can get them easily because they're, they're their natural self you know so keep it very simple just lots of natural light that's all you need that's tip number two use lots of natural light Tip number three for shooting digitals is use the right lens for the right occasion. Now for certain shots, I like using primes personally, but you can get away with using a 24 to 70 for everything when it comes to shooting digitals. Again, I just like using certain lenses for certain things and I feel like primes give you just a different vibe because you just have to move around for the shot rather than just zoom in, you know? In this shoot, I was using the 24 1.4 G Master. I was using the 50 1.2 G Master and I used the 70 to 200 G Master to get the headshots but I switched to the 50 from the 24 in this particular shot because I just liked how the 50 looked and I knew for those torso up shots it would just give me exactly what I need so yeah tip number four doesn't just apply to digitals but make sure you're giving your models feedback at all times when they're shooting you want them to feel just as confident as you are when you're shooting it so communicate accordingly and make sure they just look good for the digitals so that way they can feel confident and the shots that they're getting. So, you know, just give good feedback and make sure you communicate accordingly. So that's about it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. These are really simple tips to get the job done, but I promise you if you follow through with everything that I said in this video, you will have a better time shooting digitals if you had a problem with it before or if you didn't know how to shoot them at all. With all that being said, make sure you go check out Lee M. She's a really dope model, really dope vibes, and she always comes prepared. So what more can you ask for? If you found this video helpful in any way, make sure you share it, like it, pass it around, you know what I'm saying? Save it, whatever you gotta do, just support. Thank you so much for watching and that's about it. Peace.